Like, please don't rush me, man. There's a certain way that I like to do my thing, you know what I'm saying? H-U-N-T-Z. Consume London. Wait, wait. Back to the matter is, no, I can't let them know what the pattern is. I can't. That's why these haters get mad at this. Nah, yo, 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 yo. It's your boy H-U-N Tizzy and we're back again. It's the Golden Era UK Rap Podcast. Normally I'd say, can we get a round of applause? But still, same way, it's me and you today, so... A round of applause is in order. Oh, Do you understand, cuz? Yeah, the energy's up and that. Yeah, so big up everyone at home. Like what I normally say, um, like, subscribe, leave a little comment. comment. You know what I'm saying? Um, the algorithm nonsense and all that, yeah. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, and we've got to get in with it, man. Yeah, fam. We've got to do that, fam. Um, also, big up V-Print for you. Yeah, that's the sponsors. Mm. You can get your apparel, you know, like they'll do print your stuff for you and all that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, they've done well. They're good. Um, V-Print for you. I'm going to put the, um, the link the link and all that, the yeah. information there. Also, big up Wagwan. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What's that, the candle? Yeah? yeah, try this one. I've already had that. What flavour is that? That one there is the pineapple. Oh, I never had that one there. Whatever one, you know, whatever one, whatever you know what I'm saying? saying? Yeah, but big up Wagwan. Big you up Wagwan. Tell them Wagwan. Wagwan. Yeah. Yeah, so oh. it's the golden era. Come on. As you know, like, that's why you're here, you get me? Like, and it's about getting the people that connected the dots, that, like, the foundational bricks of... Of this thing. Of this thing. Of this thing. Of what? this, you know, like of our generation of the music. Because before it might have been British hip hop or mm. whatever name they had for it. And it was a golden era for them as well. Yeah. But And we sometimes go back into that time to find out stuff. But predominantly this podcast is about... That era. That era. You know, 2004 for me. Do you understand? Like, um. Channel U and all of them things there and YouTube 2005 and stuff yeah. and all that. You know all them ones? Because YouTube started 2005, innit? Yeah. I think I, yeah, I remember when it started. So it was DVDs yeah. and there was like, there's a world of DVDs that's lost, that's just been found recently. Yeah. Shout outs Terminator yeah. TV because he's put all the yeah, stuff up. Like that, innit? Yeah, yeah fam. He's like me even watching that's made me see certain of the DVD guys that I need to holler at. Mm. You get what I'm saying, innit? So it's just going to make it more of information. Um, and anyway, so let's get to, like, what we actually came to do. Yeah? So this is... You can see who this is, but we're going to let him introduce himself in a minute, yeah? Basically, um, when I was starting this podcast, yeah, like, I was doing another podcast from experience with my friends. Um, it was just about jokes and just anything during the lockdown time. It didn't last because mm. lockdown, <laughs> lockdown stopped and then the man then went back to doing yeah. what they was doing. But I still wanted to do podcasting. I oh, even run that from experience, golden area, innit? Yeah. Oh, I run it, I call. Do you understand what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, like, I decided to do my own one mm. where I didn't really need them to, de to, to depend on them. Do you get what I'm saying, innit? So from experience, like the brand? It's the brand, it's the and main. You got, and you got? The golden era, right. yeah. So... In this man, I started doing. I thought, let me pick a subject that I probably won't get bored of. Mm. I know a bit about. Mm. I was actually there. Part of it. Part of it. So let me call him for some favors, isn't it? So I thought, who can I call? You know what I'm saying? Like I know a lot of rappers, but who can I call? You know them ones. Like mm. who? Like who would just just do this for me instead of like asking a million questions <laughs> and being skeptical about it? You know what I'm saying? Isn't it? I thought propane. You know, propane will do that for me. Hollered at you. Where are we? You came true. Come on. You came true. Like, you oh, came true. right, brother. But it was the first one. So, yeah. man, was just learning. Because yeah. <laughs> even now, like, I get people asking me, like, how come you've been on, um, from um, Golden Era? I'm thinking, bro, I'm the first one on You're the show. You're on the first player. one, but it was like. Scroll down, but sometimes, yeah. you know, people are. Yeah, are that, lazy that and one, fun. like, we was a bit, like, we wasn't fully giving them the, the energy that. Oomph. Do you know what I'm saying in it? Like, nah, it's picked up as also well. like, go on with your thing as well because it's gone on. No, I, I remember when it started and stuff and where it was. Even I was saying to the, um, today, like, um, the studio was in, mm -hmm. it was tap and I saw like, see me like one now, like, sponsors and all that like, and the clothing and that, bro. Man, you done more big up, man. Do you know what I'm saying? Keep no, it going. Thank you, you, man. You get me. Keep it moving. Do you know so what I'm saying, bro? Thought, Come yeah, on. you know what? We're at series five now. You know mm -hmm. them ones. Like, and really and truly, we didn't get to find out everything 
because there's a, like an era of music that you did before mm. what I brought you for in the first place mm. on the first one. Mm. So why not bring him back? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like propane, you know what I'm saying? Like, come on. So without further ado, I'm going to let you introduce yourself. Yo, it's propane in the building, you know what I'm saying? Big propane. Golden era, do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Of course. Come on, cuz. Of course, we're in the building, do you know what I'm saying, my broski? Come on. Come on, cuz. You know come what I'm saying? Right. So, like, yeah. The first time I brought you here, though, cuz, yeah, yeah, I kind of, like, asked you questions about propane. Mm. Like, kind of, like, it was a bit disrespectful when I really check it, yeah, because oh. there's, like, a whole era of music that you did, yeah, with mm. the group... Yeah. You, what's the group? A YBM. YBM. Mm. Yeah. And I think we did touch on it, but we didn't. Yeah. Do you understand? We didn't break it down, break it down. You know what I'm saying, innit? And that's, like. You know, it's maybe why, yeah. Because, oh, wait. Well, I've been man there for time. That's like, that's like man who grew up with, innit? But see the music, we started putting out, like, we was doing. Gar- then again, I'm bugging because we, we, was, we, we used to do that stuff like on um, radio stations and stuff. But we yeah. didn't actually put out music till about what? 2004? Yeah, but that's. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but in 2006, but, no, 2007, mm-hmm. the group was no longer going with things no more like that. So, yeah, no, but I, you know I believe I mean? them times, how can I say it? One year, yeah. two years, feels like five years. No, I won't ever lie. See that, see that little run we had, um, Channel like, run, yeah? Feels like Channel like, run. That felt, that felt like long. Yeah. But when I prayed, it was only like two years. Yeah, like, but two, it, two it years. feels like yeah. a very long time. Same with the easy thing as well. That, that yeah. felt like it was years, but if you yeah. prayed like two years. But anyway, but that's what I'm saying. That's what's still. Do you let's know what I mean? get to the schedule of this thing, yeah, because I've got some new questions and stuff and that, yeah. Mm-hmm. So basically, yeah, normally now I'd be asking the people like school days, yeah, like and you went hybrid golf, innit? Yeah, come on. So did I. Yeah. Golf. Yeah. So come. as you, well, I don't know, like if you knew about the old, see, like the people that went to my school, yeah, like at the time of me was like tug of war and all that and Ricky mm. Blue. No. Do you know them ones like an iceberg not, slim? Not that That's what I'm yeah. saying. Uh. So you see, when you went, mm. who went? Who did, did, was there? Anyone else that? You know what I'm saying? Oh, that music guys. And music man. might be football. You know what I'm saying? Um, a lot of talented oh, schools my out boy, there. Ryan Smith played for Arsenal. My boy. Okay. Ryan Smith. Um, he kind of to be fair, he kind of showed how to play football as well. To be fair, like some skills and stuff. Big him up, Ryan Smith. Um, who else was another girl that was like? Big up Cheddar, rest in peace, Cheddar. Okay. You Much time, Cheddar Grove. boy. Um, you went to Abbey Grove. That well, man, that's a significant man. In my time, if I'm forgetting, I'm sorry, man. No, there's one producer as well. I think his name's called Steps. I think. Steps. He's, he's, I think he's from like. He does work with like the gram. Like, there's a few people that went to my school, but I can't really. I'm. You no, know I'm saying. Yeah, I'm just. Because there's a I'm lot of talented yeah, 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 schools yeah, out I'm there. I'm just not really putting. Who did my what? Um, I'm not really that. One of my last guests, yeah, Fend big him up, yeah. Um, Ra went to his school. Yeah. Jay Gang went to his school. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Um, Shaq, yeah, IOC. Jamal Edwards went to his school. Okay, okay. Do you know what I'm saying in it? Like, so there's no, a lot of talented. Like, I just, I'm just not really like. You know what I'm saying? Like remembering right, right now. But it's one of them ones though, isn't it? Hmm. Yeah, so you see, okay, so when did, because uh, you were saying something about Garage, innit, yeah? yeah? When did YBM yeah. start? Start. Well, YBM, so like, where it was, like, like we grew up in the same area, innit? So we, we, we never, like, had a name or anything. We're just rolling as friends and stuff. But I think when we started, like, um, like doing music, and I think we used to go to, like, one of the hardest crew that shot. And me, Livos, and Kitty used to go there. And um, yeah, I think one day we just like made up a crew name like YB, and but just based off of what we just though, YB though that was the name of the crew just YB, and I think yeah, but why? What, what, what made you think? Yeah, yeah, we need a name. If you get what I'm saying, was you looks looking to do music? Yeah, we was, we was, we was. It was me, Lavos, Kitty, and Super. That's who started. And it. what was it? Garage. Yeah, he was in garage at the time. That probably, who was the like, DJ? Inspired um, Super. Okay. Oh, my my, my brother Super still that was to roll at the time. And um, he used to DJ, and um, I think we mainly that guy because the Heartless Crew, like, so Heartless Crew is like a big inspiration yeah. to, um, to, to that crew even being up like, where it was, you know what I mean? So big up Heartless they Crew. They used to do like um, workshops. What? They took me to my first show, bruv. Do you okay. get me? My first show, that first. How do you mean workshop? What was that like? It was like a youth club type thing. Youth where you club. Just go like, oh, things to go there too. Over to, you go over to. Okay. That's how I think I first met from then. You used to go to the workshop? Yeah. Okay. So I was like 12, 13, them sort of yeah. times. So I used to go there. So, um, yeah, so Heartless Crew like a big inspiration. And so where was this workshop? It was in one school called Arts and Media. 
Where? Arts and Media is in um, Smith Park. It was Park mm. and that. So it was something that was like for all of, for yeah. every area. Not many to go there still. Not many like from different areas would come there still, you know what I'm saying? Like Tottenham, Green. But mainly it was like Holloway, Finbury Park, that's all there, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's why they need to bring them things back, mm. you know, because you see what that that yeah. was doing uh, man, at the time. You know, even Bigger was. Fish, they, 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 they did that too big up knee. What's Bigger Fish? Me. I always hear you like, talk about that. I never went. Yeah, but Bigger that, that was like, a, like an event. Home. Like an event for the under, I think under 18s, I think. Yeah. And um, they used to just book me like that. Like, but I, it first started like in a, in a workshop as well, like in by a thing called Kate, an adventure playground called Kate. Kate, so I think. The, the which, one you bit. which one you drink? Which one you drink? That's me. You took that already, already. Oh, <laughs> that one. Where is that? I think I've had that already still. This one's bang. Yeah, I've, I've had that one already still. My guy, what was you saying? Pe- um, Kate. So, yeah, Kate. They used to be like um, a workshop. And I think Kitty and Lavs and that, they used to all go there. And I think one day I just went there and the guy liked me, big up knee. The guy liked me and after they just started booking me, like, what, booking you, me along what, with her. For you, like, garage bars and that? Yeah, I was big garage bars. Do you remember? Do you remember? Yeah, I'm not going to spit it though, bro. <laughs> <It's> br- <laughs> you remember yeah, your first it, ever? My first, I don't think I remember my first ever though. Yeah. My first, nah, nah, nah. Because it is one. And what year are we talking as well? Sorry to keep it back. What year? It's before the golden era, mate. <laughs> <laughs> but for us to get to the golden era, we have Yeah, to... yeah, 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 before that. So that, like, yeah, must have been about. One or two, them sort of ages. Yeah. Them sort of time. Yeah. Man, just brave enough to go and like. Yeah. It took my first rave, I was like 13, Heartless Crew. <laughs> 13, like, like, I wasn't meant to go, and I told my mum, I'm saying, like, Kitty's house. These time, me and Kitty went to the rave, bruv. Just went to the rave. Went to the rave, it. like, I all had a show, I all done a mic competition, I all won it, and that. They got my Heartless Crew, though. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? I used to go to some of their, sh- um, like, they used to do it in schools. I think it was Last Man Standing or something. Yeah, they used to do something in a school, you know, like it was in like a, a, a maybe a secondary school or primary school or yeah. something. But I managed to go there and it was just like full of... Are you sure we the same thing? Ask me in school? Where was it? Somewhere in Holloway. You Somewhere might... Finsbury Park. So you might, yeah, so you might look at it as Holloway because you know... You, yeah, like, Matt, you, we're just walking there. Fam. You had any guys look at it as Holloway. Yeah, we're just walking park, there. We don't even yeah. know where we're going. We just know yeah, that probably, we're going. Yeah, probably, probably, yeah. probably the same place. Well, with, I thought we was going to a shops or something, but these times, like, no, it's in a hall. It's yeah. like a proper rave. No, no, it's not a rave. We weren't a rave. It just felt like a rave. Like, know, like, a rave. But they've been performing and stuff and that. No, they're more... Th- respectfully, that's how I learned how to, to make music. I had to write. I never knew nothing about four bars, eight bars, okay. nothing. They show me. Heartless. Bushkin, Mighty and Fonty. There's one thing to do that. Everything is saying, that's the rhyme with E. Mm-hmm. That's how I started. Because okay, I never so knew how to... What you're saying, you just took that flow and... I never had a clue, bruv. Mm-hmm. I, like, I just like music. Like, I just like Heartless Crew. My brethren bought me there, and from then that's where it went off. You know what I mean, so yeah, that's, that's when we started the crew. Like me, Lab was Kitty and Super, and then a couple years on the line, that's the garage. Push, that's push, the garage yeah. version of YB. And what did YB stand for? Stand for Young Bloods. Young Bloods. Yeah. Okay. And then Mickey added the M on it. Militia. Mickey was on that board. I don't know. He, he, bought, he, he added the M. He added the M. He come from America. I think he come from them from America or something. I said, yeah, I got this M Militia. Da, 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 da. And it's how the calls that like, we just run with. It, you know what I'm saying? What, Young Blood Militia. Okay. Yeah, because first it was YB. And then Napalm come through and said, M, at the M, do you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. So what, did you lots all have, what name was you, you wasn't, because I remember from the first one, I don't think you was um, propane, you wasn't always propane. Is, when I first moved to the end, yeah, to the, um, to the park and that, like from where I used to live before, people used to call me like, Kid, Kitty. Um, you know what I'm saying? They used to call you Kitty? Yeah. But there's Kitty Yo, already. Kid, exactly. So when I've come to the end, like, I just, you know, you know what I'm saying, my name, man. I just switched up my name, I made it Ice Kid. Was it Ice Kid first? Yeah, yeah. I think, I think it might have been Whiz Kid first, something like that. <laughs> but I think that sounded a bit nerdy. I think I told you before. Yeah. But I think it sounded a bit nerdy, like what I'm saying. Whiz, you know what I'm saying? Oh Whiz, you know what I'm saying? Then I turned into Ice Kid. And then, yeah, oh and after that, God. and after that, just, yeah, the propane after, yeah. What was the Whiz Kid for? Like, man, it was fast or something? Wizard, innit? My name's Merlin. Hunt. Oh, <laughs> Hunt, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, broken Sim down. Like that, sim it's like broken down, innit? That's that broken down. Simple, simple like, you know what I mean? Okay, and what was the Ice Kid for then? I was like, I'm just, I'm cold, like, because you see, cold. compared to that name, to yeah. your act, what your name is yeah. after, it's t- t- just a two different, just two different sides of the spectrum. I know, but the name propane. One's cold, one's hot. Yeah, but I think the name propane because it came after napalm. What was it? Was because napalm had his name called napalm. 
Napalm. Make it a name called Napalm. Do you know why he's named Napalm? I don't know why, but Napalm's a, a bomb, isn't it? A bomb, yeah. okay. So at the time, that's my boy, we're rolling. Yeah. And um, I've got ice cream, bro, for Napalm. I just don't even go, bro. It's not even signed. I told you before in the last year, it's, it's not even signed. So I was like, so yeah, man. Mm, I was still on the name. Oh. Napalm signing signing cold like, like cold and that ice cream that's like a heat man you know what I'm saying mm. so like I said nah, 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 let me change my thing you know what I'm saying at least I'm with you where, where, so where, how did you come up with shit? the propane then I do not even know you just like worked off of his yeah it was like basically kind of worked with, 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 plus he's uh, already ran the M as well isn't it like so yeah so would you say that he brought you know what I'm saying Did see when he came was he on um Garage as well no, he was on the we rap all, team we, we all mm. like, like I inspired him to rap in it you know what I'm saying because you yeah you weren't the music before Okay. I didn't know it was before him. So, so he just came with a Yeah, American so everyone everyone band. gave each other, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like vibes, you know what I'm saying? Whether it's names or whatever it's, you know what I'm saying? We all like helped encourage that. We're brothers, man, you know what I mean? Yeah. Not you know what I'm saying? That's how it is. We're brothers, you know what I'm saying? So we never look at it that way. Okay. So you said that I, before, yeah, you said that um, some of your influences were like Heartless Crew, obviously, yeah. they got you into the four bars and that, you know, like the structural yeah. thing. But what else would have been. Uh, influence for you as well as far as that it was only like part of this crew and then probably like, like the garage like, like, um, I liked Nasty Crew and Roll D they were cold because you know like when you're going home every in Monday it's been Nasty Crew 8 to 10 and Roll D 10 to 12 we're locked in every Monday so that was like my shit but also I liked rap you know what I'm saying I liked American American rap you know what I mean Styles P and shit because my first song I, I made my first song because of Styles P I first of all rap song because while I was doing garage, I was like, I don't do garage no more, man. Mm. Just a bit, mm, you know what I mean? So, mm. just wanted to probably in after that. Yeah. Did the rap shit. You just did a tune, yeah? Mm. I found it, yeah. Go on. Chronic. Ooh. <laughs> and this is what I mean. See, while, see what, chronic. what we done said, Chronic, yeah? Wow. See what we done Chronic, yeah? We was, we was actually on, on, a, on a rap vibe at the time. But Chronic was still something that we had in us. Okay. We'll just put it out, you know what I'm saying? You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. They got pace of papers on that as well. Yeah, that was like a proper grind. Garage tune, yeah. yeah. Garage that, like that, that felt like a like like grind. Yeah. It just felt it like one of the ones that would have went on. Even the beat and that, you know what I mean? It wasn't some of you. <laughs> For real. <laughs> See, you know, it was. It was some of you. So what happened? Something happened. What was it? What, so, what was the first video? They could have played a video. That video there, Kate, that what, video. What was the first video that went on Channel U? It was nobody, it was nobody really knows. Okay. That was me and, me, me and Mickey. So, you know what? I feel like I'm going too fast, yeah? So, you, you started this crew, yeah? Yeah. Right, cool. You've gone and done your first rave, yeah? Yeah. But where's, like... You know what I'm saying? Like, how old are you these times? At 13. 13. Yeah. So, like, yeah. How was a video just filmed? Like, who's got behind this... What movie? video? The video came years later. But, okay, so... Cool. 13, you've done this thing, rave, yeah? Rave, rave, This rave, yeah? Yeah. And how long... How much longer after were you doing these these raves, like building up yourselves? Oh, so probably about a year later, like 14, 15, I used to do a lot of bigger fish raves, like with, um, like it's, I was done like, they would put me one time to do a set with Wiley and that, like I was doing bears, probably like, like every, okay. like every two months, like with doing sets. Me, like I was stopped doing music, like, like kind of like early, but I think me and Key kept on going, me and Key kept on going, and um, down the line, other members came mm. to, the, to, to the crew, you know what I mean? That was, obviously no, we was all man them, yeah. But other members started started yeah. rapping. You know started I mean? rapping, and yeah. And they fell, fell no one underneath. Got, it the, wasn't a recruiting thing. No one got like recruiting. Yeah, no, like, they fell underneath the ladder of the yeah, the umbrella. I mean, it wasn't really on this like the other bringing other guy that we don't really know into the thing. It was more like if you're with us, you're with us. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. None of that recruiting. Yeah, like, that, yeah. yeah. It's man. Uh, cool. So that's what two years after the big, you know, like the so first big, time. Yeah, about so a year and a half. When do you start? You start rapping. I remember first rapping about fourteen, fifteen. So what year is that? 2000? I can't remember. 2002 or something like that. 2002. Two, three, I don't know what I'm saying. So, how old are you lots when you did Nobody Really Knows? I was 17. 17. Yeah. So, who did the video? Who filmed it? Um, do you know how crazy that was? That was like, I was in a college course, right? Yeah? And <coughs> in the history of that college course, this has never happened. That like, I've done, I made the beat, right? So when I made the beat... You made that beat? Yeah, I made the beat. Nobody um, really knows. Yeah. Which one's the one that's bang, got bang, like a... Bang, bang. We filmed Nobody Really Knows Every Day in a Row all in the same week. Yeah, but one of them had like a chairs, you know? Do you know chairs? What's chairs? It felt like it had a chairs like... Well, everybody sample. knows my name, yeah. It was a sample from like it was a, a sample. program. 
It might have been, but no, that was that was every down the road. That was every down the road. That's cheers. So we stand, we stand, we stand. Who came out? Come on, came out after. Every down, every no, not nobody really knows. Was like um like done it in the college college rap. Right? So you I, made them beats. I, I made the beat. No, not 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 every down the road. Nobody really knows. I've made the beat rap. Right? And I told the college, and this was never heard of. I told the college, right, I'm bringing my friend Mickey. Obviously, Mickey went to the course before me. I told him, right, I'm bringing Mickey to um, record a track with me. Big up Black Ripper, because he was on that course as well with me. Okay, big, big up Black Ripper still. Rest in peace. So, um, I've, he, he, he's in the video too. And nobody really knows he's in the video too. Is it? He's in the video, yeah. So, um, when um, I've told, I've told the, um, the uni, not the uni, the, the college, like, right, like, I'm going to call my friend Mickey to come do a verse, you know? Mm. Like, cool, but like, all right, babe. Done the tune, mm-hmm. it was the best tune in the class. They said, they said, let's do a video for it, spent three okay. racks on it. Okay, that's what I'm saying, spent because that's on, on like, that's always, like, spent uh, like cool. Three and a half racks Let me break it down right? for you. See, you, I'm sure you watch it, yeah? Yeah. Like, the, the ones that, of the people that we know in it, yeah? yeah? Cool. A majority of them mention you. Who? Um, Joe Black. Oh. Squeaks. Oh. Um, Jay's always like, you know what I'm saying? That's no, I'm saying no, but they're people that actually remember yeah. what they remember. Yeah. And this is the place to say the things you remember because it's about history not being rewritten. Mm. And they always mm. talk of you in a way like, see, like when, uh, uh, when they talk of you, they yeah. talk of you like, no, nah, but propane was like, mm. they never mention, they never say at no time that yeah. they was. Like, it was me and propane. Yeah. They always say, like, no, but propane was on TV. Mm. Propane was this. Like, like they, do you understand what I'm saying? Idea. That was not to do with me, bro. No, but I've always mm. thought to myself as well. How did you get on there? How did you get? No, but the second video, that was all I stopped. So it's, it's not like, like... Yeah, no, like, but that's yeah. The, the catalyst. That's the that's first the, link, yeah. That's the first link. Yeah. Do you first. understand? So they've got you a done, cameraman. What and we done, we knew, it. we knew, like, um, the, 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 the college was going to film the video. We was, you know what? Let's film every day the roads. So, so did they, you knew that they were going to put it on Channel U as well? Yeah, they told us everything. Okay. So I'm like, bro, safe. That's sick. I'm like, safe. That and is then, um, sick. And then we filmed, the other, we filmed, the, nobody really knows was filmed on a Thursday, and we filmed every day in the world on a Sunday. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? And, um, Who filmed, you filmed the second one on your own, off your own? Yeah, that was, Skinny Man gave us a link for, for a camera guy. Shout out Skinny Man. Skinny Man yeah. Well. He gave us a link for the camera guy for that still. Who, do you remember the camera guy's name? No. It's always important to and shout out these people. After that, I don't remember him. And then after that, the manager that we had, he got us a camera guy. He got us a camera manager? Guy. Why are you just saying that now when oh. I've asked you what was behind? You know what I'm saying? Like, there had to be... It felt yeah, like... We had a manager still. We had a manager still. Do you get what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, don't yeah. you think that like, <laughs> yeah, if he yeah. actually might watch this, yeah. he might think, oh, you're missing yeah. things out. You know what I'm saying? Manager still, yeah, yeah, so manager, had, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, what, so someone's seen what... How did it work? Oh, all right, so cool. We've done a little garage thing, boom, 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 whatnot. And I think the week Mickey came out from 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 um, America, um, whose idea was so these times I like, missed out a lot of parts. So these times there a lot of man I spit. So there's, there's there's me, there's me, there's Kitty, there's Napalm, there's Nogs. Uh, must have been at that time. I think Paige, but he's on and off, whatnot. What about Fresh Face? Fresh wasn't spit at that time. And Nooks's brother, he started managing us at the time. Okay. Yeah. Well, he just came through like, yeah, I'm the manager. Oh, um, like, no, no, no. I think, I, I, stuff? Think, I think there might have been a conversation. I don't know how the conversation even came apart. But I know, yeah, I know, I think, because I remember when the M name came apart, it was during that, that sort of time. Oh, and well, then we started the Militia, new, was it? Militia, yeah. And then Nooks's brother started managing us, and then, yeah, we ran from there. Mm. Yeah, no, because I watched some of them videos. He got playing, man. Big him up. Yeah. Mm. He, but, so he he knew how to get it back onto Channel U. You get what I'm saying? Um, I don't know. To be fair, I don't even know how the whole procedure even happened, but I know. It might have been, it might have been Skim mm. out. It might have been him. I'm not too sure, but I know. And when who we've... was at Channel U them times as well? Could've... Was it Ricky? I don't know, brother, I never... Oh, I, got Cat. I, was... I know Cat was there. Okay. That's one of the things I do remember. I remember Cat was there still. But, so, we should be done the video... And um, after we put everything in the roles, mm-hmm. I think Flames was handling everything. Like he had a relationship with Channel UN and was putting everything out there. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so it's important to know these things. Yeah. But you know what? I should have done this at the beginning of the show. Yeah. But it's all right. I'm going to do it right now. Let me see. All right, cool. Let me see. Hopefully, I, I can get the flow. And I've got one for you as well. Go on. We're going to see. Who said... 
I hurt your feelings. I'm at the bar with a chick and her skirt's revealing. Half my boys would have been broke if it weren't for dealing. Popping champagne like I'm trying to murk the ceiling. I have no clue, my boy. It's not for you, it's for the people at home. Oh. But still, same way, who said that bar? Leave um some comments below, you know what I'm saying? And if you're really on this thing, tell me what's the name of the track and the next two lines. Bro, yes. You can tell me my own bar and I want to remember because I swear it, to you. Well, you know what I'm saying. Especially the old one as well. So, um, all right then, let me give you something then, actually. Mm. Ah, right, cool. Who said this bar? Go on. You should know this. Go on. YBM. We're talking YBM. Yeah, right, cool. Man think they're hard like like the Vi Man think they hard like Viagra. Big four five will make you fall like Niagara. You ain't fucking with an amateur. I pick my own team, I'm the manager. That fresh? No. My own team, I'm the manager. Yeah. Say that again. Man think they're hard like Viagra. Big four five will make you fall like Niagara. That me? No. Who's that? You ain't fucking with an amateur. No. I pick my own team. I'm the manager. YBM. It's YBM. Yeah, that's not Kitty, is it? No, I'm not kidding right like that. I don't know. I don't know. I don't it's know. Kitty. But the Kitty. Yeah. What song's that? Yeah, it's a UK overstood freestyle. But you're in it as well. Which one is it? Um, the um, the one with the. Um, it's an early one. It's early. Is it like he's he wearing shades on that? Yeah. Red, red, red top. Yeah. Yeah, I can't remember it's that. Early. That's a freestyle, man. He just no, come it's out, early. It's I think early. he just come out of jail. It's yeah, early. You know yeah, what I'm saying? in a no tune. Yeah, I went, okay, but you yeah, know what I'm saying? it's not a no tune. You should have been listening to your stuff. Yeah. Uh, I'll give you one more then. Let me see. Let me give see. me one that's fair, man. All right, cool. Give me a freestyle, you know? All right, cool. Mm. Hunger strikes, I'm eating. Hunger strikes, I'm eating to eat. I dodge cops, deliver, cold of silence, reluctant to speak. That's Mickey. All right, cool, cool. Straight cool, away. Cool, cool, cool. Well, how did you get it? Cause the them, them, nah, cause them man there, yeah. And this one make it cold. Them man there was um, was rapping cold shit with big wet words on. Yeah. Man said reluctant. Yeah. <laughs> I knew it was a reluctant. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I got one more, but I'm gonna do it after. You get me? Yeah. All right. So, cuz, who would you say was the best in YBM? Um. Ooh, I would say at times it might have been me, at times it might have been Mickey. And I'm like, oh, the kitty had his goals as well, so I don't know. Oh, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going crazy. Let me let me show some respect, man. I'll say respectfully, the best I've been was Pace. Pace? Let me let me not bug that. Why? Because he could freestyle. It was, it was spin, man. Like, he's different, man. He, he, wasn't, he wasn't on as much tunes. He wasn't, he, he what wasn't, tunes was he on, though? He was on the tune with... Um, um, he's on the Chronic tune, isn't it, as well? I think so. He's on the Chronic tune. He's on a couple of tunes on the album. Yeah, Pace was cold. He was different. He was he was different. Like, and you see different. YBM, yeah. This is what I didn't know because I didn't. I different. couldn't find the stuff until recently. But it's like you lots had like a lot of collaborations with different people and stuff. Yeah. Like, like you had a skinny man. Yeah. You had yeah. a skinny man um tune. You had yeah, a that's, um. That's a big bro, man. Uh, a Mike GLC tune. Yeah, that's 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 family. Then like, remember you got a time used to work with Street Dreams, didn't it? So that's how that's how I know Mike. True Street Dreams. Big up yeah. Cobra, Paris one. You know what I'm yeah. saying? The rest so of them. after you've like. Put your music on Channel U. Mm. What's what's that done for you? What would yeah, you say? Built links to be fair. It's built up bare links. And yeah, because I think we linked linked PDC and um, I started doing jobs with like SMS. What going to and... was you going to shows and stuff like getting booked and stuff? Um, shows. Was you doing? Was there not big ones though, man? Big mm. was still like rock and roll, man. Doing certain shows there. Um, not as much show that we would. Yeah, it was doing like a few festivals here and then, but it wasn't like bare, bare shows, you know what I mean? Mm. Yeah. So what, um, what, how many mixtapes did YBM have? YBM had one album. And, one album, in it. And two mixtapes. Two mixtapes, innit? What was yeah. the mixtapes? One was, I forgot, the, it was DJ Light. I think it was called Young About Money, but volume one. And then the other one was volume two, was by Limelight. The Come Up, I think it's called. One of them. I think so, the Come Up, yeah. Big up Lana, he hosted the second part part two. Yeah, because that's the one that I found us. It had bear tunes on it mm. that I just like just yeah. just went you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, but I think I don't know, man. It's just crazy. It's a different era, isn't it? And you know, this is what I, I don't feel like I don't know, like at the time when we, we bought it out when there's a lot of turmoil going on. Yeah, there's a lot of turmoil going on, like in terms of like um 
Like, there was stuff going on. I think Kitty at the time was going jail and all that, and there was a lot of shit going on, you know what I mean? So, yeah, it just came out. And okay. after that, that was the last thing. Like, but that, what did they... The last thing I've been what, I think. Last but did thing. them M2 them mixtapes came out after the album? Yeah. So what inspired you to make an album, should I say? Um... I can't tell you the main idea, but we just, I think we were trying to work on mixtape, but we were trying to also create a, um, a good body of work, innit? Yeah. Yeah. So what, where was this? Okay, you had a manager though, innit? Yeah. So it made sense and that, innit? So what, did you feel like, see them times, did you feel like you was a part of the industry? Um, because you was on a lot of I'm, the DVDs. I'm, I'm, I've never been a part of no industry, respectfully. And well, you know, you know what, yeah. I'll tell you what I mean by that, yeah? Mm-hmm. Anything that man did, whether it's with the YBM lot, on the Idy lot, man never felt a part of it. me personally. Me, I never felt a part of the industry because everything that man did, I'm built from the ground and scratch. I'm saying from the ground up and mm-hmm. built up with no industry help. With no, like, I wasn't, I wasn't given no Charlie Sloth or no work with the type of thing there. I, I, I really wasn't. I don't think yeah. any industry but, that asked would channel you. Yeah, hey. I get what you're saying, but. Wasn't See to people or... looking on the outside. Yeah, it might look certain things. It like... might look like that because yeah. to me, you connected the dots to a lot of things happening and a lot of rappers knowing. You did a lot of A and R in and a lot of like you was like a manager without knowing it. Yeah, but one thing that I know there's 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 <laughs> there's the industry and there's the the, the street industry. And when it's that, the niggas fuck with each other, rock with each other. See when it comes mm-hmm. to that industry shit. It gets a bit bougie and a bit dodgy and the man starts picking and who they want to there and that's that's a, yeah. So it gets mucky. Yeah, that. it gets a bit all out, do you know what I mean? So it's different like. So did YBM get any um label offers? Not the man was anyway. Not I remember. It just um, seemed like Ulox was buzzing so heavy, man. Yeah. Ulox was like it wasn't part and of a lot of industry, people bro, a lot of that. people remember that mm. collective for the songs that they was, dropped. Because you put in that good music and people liked us. And like it, you had the channel U as well. Mm. That made it like cemented. Yeah, but channel U also gave us problems. But obviously, like we how? Just, like, how do you mean problems? Because I, I give you a prime prime example, right? Yeah, when we brought out every day in the rolls, mm-hmm. our next full up tune was Chronic. They okay. didn't they didn't bring that Chronic until a year later, bro. They started playing Chronic in two thousand and six. Yeah, they but were, they might have thought that it wasn't was Rocky Mo Chronic. Yeah, they. Come on, though, you just chronic. gave us no, some but, no, sick but rap listen, tune, bro. But listen, listen. You give me a we stand tall. Hmm? We came out with We Stand Tall. So we came out after because it was we, like, Okay, with Paris yeah, One. Yeah. Paris One, Northern Key. Yeah. Boom! Off again. Yeah? You see, in 06, they started playing Chronic every day. Like, why? Bear mind games. Maybe that's when um, that mind type games. of music, you know what I'm saying? It it's was fucking mind making games. a run for it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah definitely mind games. They played it a whole year later, you know? So, so we, 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 we did a little follow up. And I. Just, now you're trying to strategize. Yeah, the I remember team now. I think this was like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So how many videos did you have on Shadow You? Every day on the roads, nobody really knows. Chronic, we stand tall, and everywhere we go, five. Five, jeez. Is that it? Yeah, five. And I think I might have another one. Me, Lady Nine, Pace. But that might come on or something. That one. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. That one. Yeah, yeah. That was yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So what, cause how did you lots get the um King Apparel link? Um, I think that was that was big. That was, that was a big campaign. I think that might have been the man. I think might have been my manager at the time. You know, was that in the magazine as well, wasn't it? Yeah, cause I I, I don't I, I never had no talks with them, so I don't so, think it was the so they used to just give you care packages and stuff and that, innit? Yeah, when it's like photo shoots. So can you see why it would look to people on the outside, even yeah. like myself then? Yeah, just so there. You just like getting props, like perks of the. Remember we done one photo shoot, I think it might have been not photo shoot, it was like we done our own photo shoot, but I think they done like a cover. Yeah. And it was us, Plan B, Wretch, um, Wretch, Scorcher, like enough man, you know what I'm saying? But it wasn't like when I mean that like, oh when I say like for example, like yeah, we like that like, big up um Jenny Francis on Trace mm-hmm. FM right. She used to spin our stuff like like on, on some on some love type thing, but it wasn't really getting spun on it at all. You know what I mean? The DJs and everything would say, oh, God, good, yeah. It wasn't really, you know what I'm saying? It wasn't really... I wouldn't say it was part of the industry like that. 
Yeah. What did you put in our own work? It looked like it, but I remember even because I was doing my research and that, yeah. and I saw there was like a freestyle. It was like a freestyle and interview kind of mm. clip. But I saw of you lots and you and in it you lots were saying like, yeah, the DJs you lots don't play us. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You was actually saying it See? them times. See? That's what prompted me and thought, made me think, let me ask you lots, did yeah, you like, feel like it? Because it looked like it. I've never been part of the industry, bro. Mm. Like, like they, I don't know. Like, I, know I've known, I know a lot of people in the industry, but I don't know, it's just a bit, a bit funny, isn't it? What's YBM's um, best um, mixtape? Mi- bi- bi- best, you know what I'm saying, out of the three? Project. Best project. I'll say the album's probably the best, but the first minute has got the best energy. No. First minute is cold. What's that one? I'm gonna go. Um, Young About Money Volume One. Yeah, that, that makes it cold. But I'll say the album because the album's got more, it's got more better music in it. Yeah. But that one's more like freestyles and shit. Uh, um, what's it called? Breeze past these guys like torpedoes. Me. Extort me, me no. <laughs> me How's that workout? I ain't trying to get blood on my fresh, fresh white. white workouts. That's me. Track. Um. Uh. <laughs> can't remember you know <laughs> is it above above rappers like that nope is it got him go on yeah. next two lines then I forgot bro cause you might have saw that on a freestyle though you, you, you nah you know, nah sorry on the track what you mean they'll stand the tune in I'm asking you that <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about I'm asking you cuz <laughs> um name of the tune um above the, I can't remember what's the name of the tune it's Frontline Frontline? Yeah, Frontline with Triggs Vega. Oh, right. See, see, that, see, see that lyric there, yeah? Um, You've used it. No, I've remixed it on another tune. So the first four bars, I'll be part of this guy, that torpedo, you yeah. extort me. No, so the, that, them, them two lines, I think I've remixed it. The first four bars on another tune. Okay. So that Frontline tune was the second remix of it. I'm thinking of the first yeah, tune. Yeah, them times I think man was doing them things. Yeah, the remix. Music, take, taking the bars, like, yeah. that tune didn't do what it was meant to yeah, do. Yeah, it's bring that. remix up. Take no, I just, yeah, yeah. Maybe I just like lyrics before as well. No one never said it was wrong at the time. Yeah. I used to do it as well. Take a lyric from it and put it on other tracks. You know what I'm saying? No, no, I actually remixed the lyric. It wasn't the same bar. Okay. I actually remixed it like the yeah. same type of flow. Yeah, but I could even do that as well. Same I could even, flow. I could say like a lyric. I could say your lyric and say like Pro said. Yeah. Like, yeah. we would do that. Like, that was a LORD trait. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, teach your master, yeah. Yeah, yeah, like, like the whole that's really good. I'll yeah, just say, yeah, like, like, said, yeah, like yeah, C-Max yeah. said, yeah, yeah, you know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah. Just teeth the whole thing. Yeah, yeah. All right, cuz, so check it now. What's, uh, yeah. What would you say is, like, YBM's highlights? YBM's highlights? Give me your highlights. Um, I'll say, uh, every day on the roads, we stand tall. Um, what's another YBM highlight I would say? Can't really remember that, like, to be fair. You just did performances, man. Don't downplay the yeah, thing. I know, like, but... Like, um, like, you know what I'm saying? I know, but, 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 see, see, that... Like, you had radio spins as well. You said Jenny Francis as well. Jenny Francis. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, she had, was it, what she was it, I think, I feel it, every day on the roads, so. or... It was either... Every day on the road, or, or everywhere we go, with everywhere we go, she spun it like for like six weeks in a row. Boom, back to back. Yeah. Berry loads. I said, yes, Jenny. You know I'm saying? You've had DJ Limelight hosting the thing. You know what I'm saying? You've worked with Michael. Like, do I have yeah. to start saying the things? No, but why have we never worked with, why have we never really worked with Michael okay. like that? But them, DJ through that, that linked you to these people. He did, who? See, through the YBM days, yeah. that's what's making... Do you know what I'm saying? Things, of course. Of course, like, of course. Cause and effect of these, of of these links, isn't it? DJ Lamb, like, do you know what it is? With DJ Lamb, like, that was, that was, that was Brony, innit? So, he used to work with, he used to work with again, he used to work with someone, I think, yeah, Ruthless. Ruthless, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So, I'll, I'll link um, Lamb, like, he would send me, give me beats, or whatnot, do you know what I'm saying? So, but yeah. Mm. So, Brody still. Yeah, he used to do the mixtapes back then. He had yeah, yeah. People. Like, they had a Ruthless roster of rappers, tapes. innit? Yeah. But you know what, cuz, yeah? They got Ruthless, man. I've got two more questions <clears> for you, yeah? Go on. Um, I feel like you would be someone that could actually like give this a proper answer. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So like, I'd like to ask you, what would what would you say is the criteria to being a goat, to having the label goat? Um, 
Everyone's going to look at it in different ways, right, yeah? What does the word GOAT mean to you? The greatest of all time, but see where that, that word GOAT, greatest of all time? Mm -hmm. Greatest, not greatest, just greatest. Oh, thank That's you. That's one person. Thank you, thank you, but thank you. So but I don't want to say my opinion. You say your opinion, yeah. Gun. Uh, I would say that, that it can't be too much gold. It can't be. That's. I feel like the word. That's why a Mount crazy. Rushmore might have got made. Yeah, what yeah. Because the greatest of I'm saying, but greatest oh. of all time means one for that sector, yeah. isn't it? But obviously. So that's I'm a, asking you, what's the criteria? What would you say is the criteria to um, be a gold? Oh, um, the criteria. I would say. I don't know. To me, like you got. To, like people are gonna have their opinions in it in terms of like um the music and the fan but I feel like it's like it's like it's like Messi right and Ronaldo right yeah? Champions League World Cup your league the FA Cups see with them boxes they're ticked mm. yeah bro not could you scored fifty goals in one season bro and you mm. smashed it that's cool so are they, they're, both the, goats. Eh? they're both goats. I will say that because they've they've ticked all the boxes. Yeah? And see for me as a rapper rap, for me I look at it. For, for someone to be a goat, I would say the numbers. The shows. What if you came out in a time when you see like Mike GLC? Yeah. He sold the CDs himself. Yeah. And when he says the numbers, everyone says, No, you didn't. Yeah. Do you get what I'm saying, innit? We're talking about numbers. When you say numbers, you might mm. be talking about current, you know, like on the computer right now. Do you know what I'm saying, Bro, do you, uh, for example, right, yeah? Do you, know, do you know who's coming in that conversation, bro? DBE. They're, in, they're, they're on conversations, bro. Because their man ain't got no bloody... Um, I think they've got a distribution. But they ain't got num, some... They're not, they're not directly... Like, they, ain't got, they ain't directly signed, so they kind of got distribution, right, yeah? Bro, they're doing mad stuff. That's gold shit they're doing. Selling that mad arenas and what, and, and that's 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 dope shit. Mm -hmm. So when I'm saying on, on that level there, in terms of like you're doing, sh cause you could um you could um put your stuff on on Spotify and get ten billion streams. Mm -hmm. You might have finesse that, bro. Do a show. Mm -hmm. Do a show and see how that goes. Mm -hmm. You might be lying to the people, cause mm -hmm. you might have finesse the numbers lie sometimes. You know what I'm saying? People yeah. say numbers don't lie. Shut up, man. Numbers can lie, bro. Yeah. And I'm buying views and do these streams and shit. So when it comes to them type of shows, there they're proving to people. Which that that I even signed can't do, bro. Mm. So I would say they're on. So numbers. They 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 they, 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 they can be involved in some conversations. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm saying so. Yeah, I'll say that man. And and a man can have one good year, and, and I'm saying, whoa, mm. that's cool, man. Yeah. That's not gold shit. I'll say consistent. Like I see a man like a Michael J. So what numbers? Go on, give me a, like a. I would give say. Me, give me I'll about, say, Can you give me five pointers? I'll say numbers. Or how, how many pointers? How many things do you say? Nah, they gotta tick this box to to get in this conversation. Um, I'll say numbers. I'll say shows. I would say um. I want to say awards, yeah, but awards can be booked, bro, man. Mm. <laughs> awards, yeah. awards can be booked, yeah. bro. So I want to say, I want to say awards, bro. Say you're not a part of the machine. Man, I'm paying to get awards, bro. Say you're bro. a part of the machine that don't... Huh? Like, say you're, yeah. a part, you're not a part of the machine, so you don't get nominated for that. Pardon? Say you're not a part of the machine. Yeah, say so you're, I can't you're, even... Your runs with I, 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 I don't want to put awards in there. I don't, because awards... Man, I'm buying, man, I'm buying awards, bro. I don't think you can buy people to come to your show. 20,000 people to come to... I don't think... Can, can you buy that? No, they you can't have to, buy you, that, bro. You, you no. Know. So I would say I would say probably like numbers sold, even though numbers can be manipulated too, but I'll put that in there. I'll say numbers sold in shows, man. Probably other two, another another two stuff, but I'm not really. What about the actual <laughs> music? What do you mean? <laughs> like their sold? talent. I mean, what about their talent? Uh, Don't that count? <laughs> that's 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 your that's your preference, bro. That's your preference. Like they are the man over there to Jay. I think Jay's shit. Rock. That's his preference. Um, I forgot it was um, one American guy. Every day he's rubbish, but that's 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 his preference. So they're... like for example, like <clears throat> like DBE is what they're doing, but not everyone might like them. Not everyone might like the Dave. Not everyone might like Stormzy. Yeah, it's your true. preference, bro. That is true. You know what I'm saying? So it's what you might like. So <clears throat> and I believe that um that's 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 what's the word called again? Um, oh, but anyway. <laughs> Um, as long as as long as um like the 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 fans are like for example I believe that they've got like a cult. Mm -hmm. 
because I'm talking about DB, they got like a cult. Yeah. That becomes different to this like, normal fan because they're not ready to switch, switch, switch up on it, bro. You know what mm. I mean? Yeah. So I'll say they probably like in the conversation terms that like, oh, I know that. Obviously that like, the a Skeppy or uh, Storms here, uh, yeah, of course. But uh, word, uh, I think man is over drag words now. Cause what's what's go of all time could be one person. Mm. It can't be ten people. Yeah. That's just how I look at things, you know what I mean? No, interesting, you know what I'm saying? I can clip that up and put that up for more debate. Yeah. <laughs> That's what these questions are for, some of them, you know what I'm saying? As well as finding out the history. Yeah. So, all right, so let's kind of like get to the last one mm. of the, because this has been like an epic one and I feel yeah. like, because I remember the first episode, mm. I know that we've touched on stuff that we never touched on in the first one and now we're in a better setting, yeah. more relaxed, you get me? People can more take this one in, you know what I'm saying? Boom. So, obviously, what's new, what's next? But, obviously, I know that you have to be telling us about your latest performance that you did and mm. the whole movement behind that. So, yeah. let, um, let us know. Big up Ox on that one there still because um, I think it might be now. Probably, like, just before summer. Mm -hmm. He's telling me, like, oh, let's, let's do a show, you know what I'm saying? And, um, and straight away, like, he like, had that idea as whatnot. And made it happen, you know what I'm saying? We got a big Oxford that's there. And we've done the show, it might have, what was it? It was in it was November. And um, we had a few guests come out. And it was sick, bruv. I won't even lie, like, like, cause, like, cause, oh, it felt good. Like, like, I had performed in a while, right, yeah? So for me to perform and do like a headline show and all that, yeah. It was sick. Was that bruv. your first headline show? Yeah, it was a headline show. No, and that was like three of us. It wasn't like my headline show, it was me, mm. Ox, and Ten. So um, that was like our headline show. We all had like separate lap sets, you know what I'm saying? And um, yeah, like for me not to perform for a while, but perform that was like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, so we smashed it, man. So big up Ox for that, big up Tingas for that, you know what I'm saying? Big up you, you came through as well. Big up um, Paris One, Tex, Kaz, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, the like Everyone a larger through. rate, innit? I swear, yeah, big Dead cakes, and that was their Dead Big car. cakes, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, that's it. Logic. <laughs> <laughs> Logic, Logic, yeah, man. Come on. Nah, that was sick and that, you know. It was like Big up Kiddy as well, you came and performed um Yeah, you did some YBM world. tracks and yeah. that as well. Big up it? Slime. How you, you came out there. Yeah, he smashed it still. Big up Slime for that. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So what are you planning on doing anymore? And um probably hopefully again in, in the future to share or something, man. God willing, man, you know what I mean? Yeah. What are you yeah, gonna man. be bringing um prolific back as well? We got some so, shit on the way. Yeah. Going through designs right now. I've been slacking a lot for that deal, but I'm going through designs right now. So, yeah, probably like May, June, touching the streets again, you know what I mean? What about music? Um, do, 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 do. Probably like May times, April, May. Okay, I'm so in the you're always working. I'm in the kitchen, I'm in the kitchen right now. I'm okay. just literally just, um, just, 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 order the last bits of tracks and all that, you know what I'm saying? And then, um, yeah, I'm in the kitchen, man, so about April, May times. Yeah. yeah. Ah, I look forward to hearing that. The and what's it called? You see that I'm top 10? You documented it, innit? You filmed yeah, it, innit? Where's that, the footage, that, man? That should be coming out on YouTube anytime soon. Yeah, so I can put the links. You know yeah, what I'm saying? That so that should be coming in. Everything that should be coming anytime soon. You've got like, um, Check that different out. segments of everyone performing and all that. So yeah, that should be coming out anytime soon still. Yeah. All right, well, cuz, you know what, yeah? Like, I feel like, you know, because I'm mentally here, yeah. but I'm also thinking about it's the camera angle. You know, like, I've yeah. got bare things going on, yeah. but I have been listening to, like, what you're saying because this is actually very interesting. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> nah, because you've got to make yeah. sure the thing's running yeah. properly. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Of but course. I'm proper happy that you came through, because and yeah. repped again because this one, I know, yeah, is a much better representation. The other one... Do you think the other, you other interview, do you think this one's better than the other one? Yeah, cuz. you think so? Yeah, man. The other one gets good, like, near the end when you're a bit more... And then when I watch it, <laughs> what pisses me off, the microphone's in your face, fam. Yeah, it's, it's like, we can't really yeah, see you, so uh, it's a bit mad. Yeah. That that annoys me. Yeah. There's little things that annoy me. Like, in the the, the viewer might just be all right with it, but yeah. me, I know. Because it's you your know, product, it's it? my it's product, content, innit? I want it to look a certain way, you know what I'm saying, innit? Of course. It? But, like, yeah, cuz, I'm glad you came through. You get me, like... Come on, bro, Lee. Every single time, I'll yeah. pull up, man. Respect for that, you know what I'm bro. saying? So, listen, it's your boy, H-U-N Tizzy, and this is the Golden Era UK Rap Podcast with... Propane, you don't know. Big Propane. Yeah, you. shout out YBM. We got until YBM, next we got time. Man, we don't know. Until next time, people. So you know I'm love, love, don't know. Yo, tell them wait, bum.
Like, please don't rush me, man. The certain way that I like to do my things, you know what I'm saying? H-U-N Tizzy. Consume London. Wait, wait.